Hey guys, it's Ro. Welcome back to my channel. This video is not planned. It's in the middle of the week. My boyfriend Husky surprised me with a new puppy. It was so sweet. Go to his channel, youtube.com slash husky. I was literally taking a nap. We had woke up early. We were doing a bunch of like business calls. I'm so excited and so happy and I really wanted to make a video for you guys to meet her. Here is the new member of our family. She's about nine weeks old and she's just so cute. I don't have a name for her yet. So I've never done this before, but I'm gonna ask you guys for help. The names that we're thinking about are Cupcake. I've I feel like it's very classic, like, hey Cupcake, how you doing? Another name I've been considering is Milkshake, cause it's sweet and a little sassy. I even like the name Vanilla Bane. Look at her, she looks like vanilla ice cream. So please help me, let me know in the comments below which name you like the best, or if you have any other names that you've been thinking about, but those are the three that I've been calling her, and I basically call her all of them. I'm like, Cupcake, Vanilla Bane. It kind of just keeps going. Well, she's sleeping, so I'm gonna put her down, let her rest, and I'm gonna show you guys a mini puppy haul that I did online. Here's my mini online haul. And by mini, I mean I didn't go as hashtag ridiculous as I did for my first two dogs, Cookie and Blueberry, because I had a lot of the essentials. I got a bunch of stuff on Chewy.com, so that's a really good site to go shopping if pet stores in your area are closed right now because they've been online for so long so they're really good about shipping and getting things to you quickly so I really appreciate that. The first thing I bought was more stain remover and puppy pads. I really like the brand Nature's Miracle. I used this with um, my dogs in the past and it really helps for stains so this is one of my favorite. I got stain remover for hardwoods and I got some stain remover for carpets and then I got some heavier duty or stuff for bigger stains. Because when you have puppies Accidents will happen. There's a lot going on here. I'm actually gonna tie my hair. I'm gonna do a little braid, put it back, get it out of the way. Also, this is a great time to braid my hair because Puppy likes to chew on it, so let's put it back. Cause she is teething. Both the puppies I've had in the past have teethed, but not like this. She's the youngest puppy and she's gonna be teething for like the next six weeks. Those little puppy teeth are razor sharp. You have to wear shoes around puppies because they just buy everything. They think everything's a toy. Here's my little hair tutorial. You do your braid and then you give it a little stretch. A little stretch, a little stretch, but not too far, otherwise your braid will fall out. There we go, hair's out of the way. I ordered a bunch of little teething toys and this is gonna help because their gums are sore, their puppy teeth are gonna be falling out and they're gonna just want to teeth, teeth, teeth till their adult teeth come in. So these are great and I got a bunch of them. I got with textured, I got them like flavored, anything I could find that was like teething. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys look how small they are. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm raising another puppy again. I told myself that the next dog I would adopt would be a dog, like an adult dog. But oh, they're so cute, they're so cute. I love this brand, I buy their stuff all the time. Now this toy is from Zippy Paws, and these are what they called like bur burrowing, burrowing? toys where they have a main toy and they have these little toys and you stick them inside and then the dog has to like work its way to get the toy out of there. And I love them and they have so many different like themes but I got her this little honey pot with little bees. Cause she's just sweet as honey. She's so sweet. So that's her little toy right there. Oh, <gasps> it's so cute. And speaking of toys, I could not resist food toys. As a foodie, I just think that these are so adorable. So I got some rope toys so she can really like teeth and play with it. And what? Molly, look at this, it's Tootsie Roll. It's not the butterfly, it's the Tootsie Roll. It's a brand new dancer, 20 years ago, yeah. <laughs> Okay, this is giving me middle school vibes and you may not remember this, but I used to dance to a dance called Tootsie Roll. Let me see a Tootsie Roll. There we go, there we go. We also have a pretzel that looks like it's from Wessels. <laughs> Molly, are you salivating right now? Now all I want is a mole pretzel. Ooh, Molly wants that Wessels pretzels. Ooh, which, which, ooh. <laughs> Now I didn't want Blueberry to feel left out, so I did get her some adult chew toys, but I also got Blueberry this cute little shark sweater. Like how cute is this? She can run around and be a little shark. 
Blueberry loves wearing outfits and I got her a medium, but now the last like two weeks, she just got really long. She finally filled out around a year, a year and a half. Frenchies like take their final form, kind of like a Pokemon. Like it's the last level of <laughs> evolving and they're really little and then they're kind of skinny. And then right at a year, a year and a half, they just kind of fill in. That's their, and I bought this right before she filled in. In like two weeks, she's filled in and I don't actually know if she can fit this now. I'm convinced Blueberry might be part French Bulldog, part wiener dog. She's a French weenie maybe, I don't know. Look how long she is. She's like long cat. I know, you're so cute. Oh yes, but then you'll sleep better at night. Look how long she is. She can't even fit in frame how long she is. Wow, long Frenchie. You have the long legs, you're so <laughs> cute. You what? You got lipstick on her cheek. Oh, that's just because mommy loves you. So the more lipstick you have on you, the more mommy loves you. Oh, that's embarrassing. You know what? She just has wearing a little blush. No, that's not coming off. Okay, we'll, we'll take a bath later. So I got Blueberry the shark outfit, some adult bones, and this little number. What a Burberry scarf. You know, Blueberry's bougie. That's who she is. And I really wanted to let her embrace that. So we're gonna do a little photo shoot today where Blueberry Muffin is gonna become Burberry Muffin. You know, wrapping it around, be a little Burberry Muffin. It's just her look, it's perfect. She loves it. Beautiful. And the last thing I got, which is the biggest, is a dog bed and I love it. I got this from the online store Front Gate and I really liked it because this bed can fit two Frenchies comfortably. I really love this pillow edge that goes all the way around. It's super soft and Blueberry actually rests her head on it like a pillow. Frenchies have really big heads, so it gives them neck support. And I love it because she, she uses it like a pillow. So she's like this bed more than any other bed that I've gotten them before. This was called the Comfy Couch Pet Bed, and this is the color Platinum. It comes in a few different colors, but I really like this because it was really neutral. It's so easy. If you want to wash anything, you can just pop this pillow out and wash it and then tuck it back in there. It's super easy. All right, that does it for the mini haul. I may do another one when stores are open again, but these are just some of the really cute, fun things that I found online and honestly, I love this dog bed. I brought a bunch of dog beds in my life and I've learned that if you get one that's just a little nicer, it lasts so much longer. And honestly, a couple of the dog beds that I bought in the past have been from kind of designer brands that are more expensive and they just didn't have the features that this one had. I feel like I'm talking about a car and I'm talking about the features of this car, but when you've lived life and you have experienced things, you wanna share that knowledge with other people. And basically the pillow beds that don't have this support are cool. The dogs are okay with them, but they prefer this one. They want a pillow. They want head support, neck support, and I just regret that I didn't get one sooner for them. What are you gonna do? Hindsight's 2020, so I'm telling you guys now. Thank you, Frontgate, for making this. My dogs love this bed. They love it more than any bed we've ever had, so thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, we're just starting to have some movement. We might need to take these dogs, go have some playtime. All right, come on, let's go play. Pups are awake, they're ready to play, so we're gonna go on to the new and improved puppy porch over here. We just had the deck redone. We have it weatherproof because it was leaking all over the place. It had eight leaks in it underneath while we were getting all of that rain in California. And so, da-da! <gasps> Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? I ordered an outdoor rug from Target. We brought up a love seat. Instead of the chairs, I gave the chairs to my mom. It's just such a great porch for the dogs because it's in the shade, so it doesn't get as hot up here. We live in Southern California, so it gets really hot. So over here, it's really shady. This is the perfect little porch for them because it connects to our bedroom. Our bedroom's over here. So in the morning or at night when they have to go to the bathroom, we made an improvement to their little potty area. So over here, we used to have a plastic AstroTurf potty pad 
and it worked okay it had great drainage but I found something more natural and it's just so amazing and awesome the old one smelled all the time even for a neat freak who was cleaning it all the time it just smelled it smelled so bad the only way to get it smelling totally better was to order a new plastic astroturf and I just didn't want to be buying plastic 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 over and over again so I found a really natural option I should have mentioned this before because it's awesome and I wish Mike we knew about these when we had an apartment yeah because our apartment had this little deck and had I known about this company maybe we would have got a puppy even sooner because <laughs> this is so cool yeah it's nice I just okay this video is not sponsored but if you live in an apartment and you have a little balcony this is just such a great option this is so cool so this company will mail you a patch of fresh grass real grass like with the dirt it's called fresh patch you can get a new patch like every month or week you can sign up for whatever you want and <laughs> it's completely natural it comes in cardboard and the best thing is when the dogs are done using it you can just compost it I love it it's more green and it does not smell and it stays really dry like I said we live in Southern California so it's really dry here but I have had no moisture problems with it it's just been awesome all around so again i don't know who made fresh patch but thank you for doing it we love it it's so good for pie training yeah she loves it she's already learning how to go here see you can see kind of the yellow spots those are the hot spots <laughs> Alright, that does it for a meet my new puppy video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm so excited for this little baby girl to join the family. And I can't believe it's already been a year since we got Blueberry. And now she has a new sister. Oh, mommy loves the kissies. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Ooh. Let me know in the comments below what we should name her. Is she a cupcake? Is she a vanilla bean? Is she a milkshake? Let me know because I'm having a hard time and right now Mike is calling her TBD and I'm like you can't call her that she's gonna think that's her name Michael because her name's to be decided so I we know, but you can't call her TBD she's gonna think that's her name <laughs> <laughs> hey TBD no no Mike, TBD. Stop. don't listen TBD. puppy puppy cover your ears earmuffs that's not your name <laughs> Also, if you'd like to watch the video of Mike surprising me with this cute little baby girl, I'll put a link down below. It is so cute. It was so sweet. We talked about getting a new puppy for a while, but I didn't actually know he was going to make it happen, especially during like when we were staying at home. I didn't think, I, I just didn't think it would be possible. But we've got this new bundle of joy in our lives and she is so tired from playing. Look how good we did. We wore out. She's ready for dinner in bed. She's like falling asleep in my hands. <gasps> Okay, I'm gonna let her rest. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. See you guys soon. Bye. And if you wanna watch any other videos, you can click up here or up here. I would use my hands, but she's just so cute. And she's like,